Hey, how are we doing, guys? Thanks for tuning in as we check out Just In Time Incorporated on PSVR. Coming from the small team at Second Wind Interactive, Just In Time Incorporated is a simple yet devilishly fun game. You play an insurance agent who has been given a set of hypergloves that allow you to slow down time, all in an attempt to prevent your clients meeting their demise in a variety of creative situations. After a couple of quick tutorials, the game wastes no time thrusting you into saving clients, spoofing some real and fictional characters such as Neo from The Matrix and President Trump. And did I mention you can take people's trousers off? The basic premise is reflected in the game's presentation, but don't let that put you off. The Minecraft style graphics serve the core gameplay well, looking very sharp on the PS4 Pro and adding to the charm the game has in abundance. And this pixel perfect presentation is very much needed as you start plucking bullets out of the air and ripping the shirts from people's backs. Animations and texture work are rudimentary but help keep the focus on your surroundings, especially when the action becomes chaotic, stopping the screen descending into a cluttered mess. Welcome to Just In Time Incorporated. Your new voice work is minimal, with the lone voice of your computer chaperone providing instruction and commentary on your actions. As the game wears its movie and pop culture influences on its sleeve, each stage is appropriately scored for the personal movie it's sending up, with music ranging from overly epic to slightly camp, enhancing the winks and nods the developers have given to the player. Gameplay mechanics are served via teleportation and click turning using the move controllers to manipulate objects and people with proficient tracking and responsive controls, which is just as well as some levels can be fiendishly difficult, requiring thought and dexterity in equal measure. All of the levels are in slow motion, with only the hub-based world moving in real time. The game can most likely be compared to a more action-orientated job simulator, not just in terms of its structure and presentation, but just how fun it is. With 14 missions and four bonus ones, some people might think it's a little short, clocking in at around 2-3 to three hours in total. But it's appropriately priced and never outstays its welcome, with some randomisation of missions thrown in for good measure, just to keep you on your toes. For trophy hunters, I'm pleased to say this game includes a platinum and can be obtained in 3-4 to four hours. The game rewards you nicely, doling out a trophy for each mission completed. However, there are some trophies that are action specific, requiring you to adhere to certain criteria such as poison 15 crows or avoid killing anyone. Much like the game itself, achieving these trophies normally verge on the right side of challenging, forcing you to experiment and shouldn't be too difficult once you've made more than a handful of attempts. I'd rate the platinum difficulty at 3 out of 10, but could be lowered with some guides on some of the more skill based trophies. With some sharply written and choreographed scenarios, Just In Time Incorporated will have you smiling ear to ear throughout its short runtime. Its playfulness reels you in and the love and attention the developers have poured into it really shines through. And who would have thought being an insurance agent and stripping enemies down to their undercrackers could be so much fun? 